Da sind wir wieder bei Game of Thrones, Episode 2, The Lost Lords. Und Roderick Forrester ist aufgewacht. Ich darf spielen. Ja, war klar. Morning, Talia. Good to see you again. Roderick, thank the gods. Brother, I think I lost you. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. I didn't mean to hurt you. Are you all right? Come here, sister. How bad is it? <laughs> Maestor Tengren says your leg may never fully heal. And your face. Oh, you tell them it don't look good. I wouldn't dare. Roderick, something you need to know. Ethan is dead. Ethan? Bruce Bolton's bastard came here and threatened to take me away. Ethan didn't even resist. And that monster put a blade through his throat. Like it was nothing. Ethan? How could this happen to him? I can't believe he's gone. Me neither. We're planning to honor Ethan in the grove, alongside father. And now mother wants me to write this song for the funeral. I can't. <laughs> You can, Talia. I know you can. <laughs> it's been chaos here since he died. We have White Hill soldiers stationed in our courtyard. Even the small folk don't feel safe. You need to show everyone who this house belongs to. They need a lord. You're still a hero to them. If you lead, others will follow. I know you still need time to heal, but... I'll be fine, Talia. The council's meeting in the Great Hall right now, actually. Nobody expects you there, but if you think you're ready... I want to go. Can you even stand? They could use your leadership. Only one way to find out. Die brauchen halt auch so einen Hodor, der ihn trägt. I missed you, brother. You can do this, Roderick. I know you can. Na dann, probier ich das mal. Gleich voll auf die Fresse wahrscheinlich. Willst du mir morgen? Die meiste Zeit schaffe ich es aber nicht bis zur Tür. Ja, siehst du mal. Au. Patrick. Au. I'm fine. Oh ja. Why'd you do that? I won't <coughs> let anyone see you like this. Not when the house appears so weak already. I need to attend that meeting. And you will. But you will get there on your feet. It's a long way to the Great Hall. We can't risk you falling where others can see. Take my hand. Let me help you. Thank you, Talia. Ready? That's it. <coughs> I 
Everyone will be so glad to see you up. Though, I think you'll find that much has changed. Ich finde es ganz cool, dass er jetzt doch spielbar ist, weil wir haben ja beim ersten Mal gedacht, dann nehmen wir sie den ersten gleich raus. Ja. Oh, und an der Wall, der Jared. Normal ist bei Game of Thrones ja umgekehrt, dass Leute sterben, mit denen man, wo man nicht damit rechnet und diesmal ist es eher umgekehrt. Da oben war was zum Gucken. Ich glaube, der Augen so. So this is the seat of the Night's Watch. Da doch. Ach da. Ich freue mich so auf die nächste Staffel ja. der Fernsehserie. Ich habe gemerkt, als vorhin das Intro lief mit der sensationellen Musik halt. The Wall. Always wanted to see it. But not like this. Die Musik losging. Das nicht mehr lange hin. Mhm. Es gibt wenig Sachen, auf die ich mich so sehr freue im Moment. Oh, das kann man auch aus der Serie. Das ist ganz cool. Zumindest hat die Orte auch so, die sie schön nachgebaut haben. Your arrival, is it? Another one for Frostfinger. On a horse, no less. Ja, wie wenn du morgens ins Büro kommst. Built by giants, doesn't it? You're new here to take the black, because you got that look about you. I need to speak to the Lord Commander. We uh, don't have one right now. It's Frostfinger you want. He'll get you sorted out. Which one's Frostfinger? That grizzled old prune over there. Says us new recruits are all dead men. But don't let him scare you. <laughs> That's just his way. You seem nice. That's not so good round here. You fight like a girl. A woggling girl, maybe. What's in these barrels? It's pitch. Dump it off the wall and it'll burn the wildlings down to their fucking bones. Benutzen will ich das mal nicht. Nicht gleich, dass wir die Brachen und hier Teer im Innenhof verteilen. Das weiß er nicht. Tuttle, nephew to Duncan Tuttle, Castellan of Ironrath. Garrett Tuttle of Ironrath. And how does a Castellan's nephew get himself sent to the wall? You're a thief, a raper. You abandon your post, or do you just fancy dying someplace cold? Actually, I'd like to volunteer. Hmm. You just want to serve the realm, is that it? Yes, sir. You arrive on horseback. Wearing a soldier's livery. You're a bad liar, Garrett Tuttle. Sir? From Duncan Tuttle, Castellan of House Forester. My uncle wrote to the Night's Watch. He goes on for a bit, but then he asks us to make you a ranger. As if it's a knighthood. So you see, Tuttle, I know all about you. You lied to me the first chance you've got. <laughs> You'll fit in well here. You don't know me as well as you think. I know enough. Now then, 
will start your training in the morning. For today, you need a cot and a cloak. Understood. Oh, and Tuttle. Sooner or later, the Night's Watch will be your death. When it comes, try to make it quick. Ein sehr lebenslustiger Geselle. <lacht> Die sind alle so optimistisch da. And last we'd heard, Asher was in Slaver's Bay. So Malcolm caught a ship headed for. I heard they took him off a corpse cart. <lacht> And he's missing his arms and legs. <lacht> At least he can still eat and shit. The White Hill soldiers are drunk again. <lacht> And we have too few men to handle them. Let's just get to the Great Hall. Well, I say he's dead. And they've dressed up some peasant in his place. Fill me up, would you? And bring us some salted pork while you're at it. <laughs> Fill yourself up, you lazy fuck. Is that him? Has to be, doesn't it? He's hideous. <laughs> Had a He's run in a with Walder Frey, did you? And he's leaning on a girl. Should have buried him with the corpses. Forest is Real cursed. shame about your leg, you give us a toss. Don't let go of your sister now. We have business in the Great Hall. Go round. Move aside, soldier. I'm quite comfortable, thank you. And I don't think you're gonna make me. I wonder what's weaker. Your legs? Or this house? Move now. Hola. Go on then, my lord. Hat er denn da überhaupt noch was zu sagen? Ja, yeah, der Roderick. Ja, ja, als Lord. Ich meine, wenn das unter Whitehill Besetzung ist. Das ja. Klar, aber trotzdem ist er noch Lord auch des Hauses. Das wird schon respektiert noch. Also auch Ach von so. dem Whitehill selber noch. So halb. Also natürlich trotzdem kannst du nicht nach Belieben machen, was du willst. Like the wine keeps their wits dull. It makes us look weak. Both of you, please. So you'd rather they riot? Duncan, you're a damn fool sometimes. It doesn't matter what you think. I was chosen as Sentinel. My lords. Roderick, my boy. Come, join us. Lady Talia, you should have told us the Lord needed help. It's good. It's good to see you awake, Lord Roderick. We didn't expect you so soon. The Maester said it would be weeks before you were walking, if you walked again at all. It was highly probable. Maester Otengrin doesn't know everything. Those are fees. Who among us does? Who oh, indeed? That's what I was going to told me the state of our house. <laughs> Then you know our situation is grim, my lord. No thanks to your sentinel. He's been getting the White Hill soldiers drunk. It keeps them off their guard. They think you're a bloody fool. My lords, please. Oh, oh, I'm a fool. At least I was there by Ethan's side when Ramsay stole. Duncan. I've told you. I was keeping an eye on the Bolton soldiers. You should have been protecting your lord. Now Ethan's dead. And Ryan a hostage. And what have you done to get him back? Nothing. I am your lord. 
Of course. Apologies, my lord. The White Hills have my brother. We fight amongst ourselves, when we should be fighting them. We'd need an army to win that fight. And we don't have one. Not anymore. Summon our allies, then. I'm afraid we have none left, my lord. We've heard little from the Glovers since the Ironborn took Deepwood Mott. Halsey's Helliver, Grayson and Brownbarrow were all slaughtered at the Twins. And the rest of our allies are terrified of the Boltons. You forget the Glenmores. You'd be wed to Elena Glenmore already, if not for the war. And her father is no coward. Now that you've returned, the marriage can proceed as planned. The marriage? Well, much has changed. The Glenmores may no longer desire the Union. Lady Elena will decide for herself. Your betrothed is on her way here as we speak. Lady Elena? She's coming now! He's barely recovered. Why is she coming here? She means to pay her respects to your father. But it could also be a chance to solidify our arrangement. If she still wishes to marry, we'd have the allies we so desperately need. Their army would become oath-bound to Roderick. And we could burn High Point to the fucking ground! Yes, this marriage could be our chance. Of course, we must hope Lady Elena still wants to marry Roderick. We're talking about a marriage, not an Ironwood contract. Sieht doch kernig aus. I'm certain I can convince her. She's always been fond of you. Just be careful not to push Elena too hard. If Elena does come to Ironrath, she'll see those soldiers in the courtyard. We starve them out, and they'll have to leave. I'd rather they be lying around drunk than setting the stables on fire. My lord, perhaps you could put an end to this tiresome dispute. Just handle it. We could keep them fed, but take away their wine. Well, that'd be something at least. Good. Now, there's nothing more to discuss. Maester, it's time to light the ironwood torches. Yes, my lady. Welcome back, my lord. It's got to be back. Gregor last lit these torches when his mother passed. Ironwood doesn't burn easily, he told me. But foresters have a way. And now we light them for him and Ethan. How is your song coming? Ethan always helped me with music. It's not the same without him. You're a fine musician, Talia. You'll do a great job. Everyone knows how much Ethan meant to you. I'm sure it will honor him well. About Elena, I've sent a letter to Mira. The Tyrells hold much influence over the Glenmores. I don't know where things stand between her and Lady Marjorie, but maybe your sister can find a way to help. It's entirely ridiculous. If it's not the flowers, it's the food or the table settings. Is that the letter to the orphanage? Yes, my lady. It's nearly done. Make sure to tell them we'll send all the leftovers. And mm, something nice after that. You and the children are ever in our thoughts. A lovely sentiment, Mira. And the seal. Here you are. Oh, are there any more invitations to send, or are we finally done with the cursed things? One more. An invitation to Sir Maynard. Ah, yes. One of my father's favorite drinking companions.
I have a letter for Lady Mira Forrester. Thank you. My pleasure, Lady Mira. <clears throat> what is it, Mira? It's from my mother. She asks that I help ensure Roderick's betrothal to Elena Glenmore remain intact. How can you do that from a thousand leagues away? Ah. It's my help she's after, isn't it? She's a bold woman. Most would shy away from asking such things. Forgive my mother. She doesn't see the harm in what she does. She's not entirely wrong. A letter from me could encourage the Glenmores to honor the betrothal. But it wouldn't be very discreet you'd be forcing their hand. That isn't the way I do things. You pushed me before and you saw the results. I'm sure your brother can secure the marriage on his own. Boo. Blöde Kuh. Was anders gelaufen wäre, wenn wir am Anfang was anders entschieden hätten in der ersten ja, Folge. Mira, we'll talk more later. Dass wir jetzt die Chance gehabt hätten, dass sie uns hilft, wenn wir es in der ersten Folge nicht verlangt hätten, sozusagen. Mm. Schwierig zu sagen. Ja, wie man es kennt aus King's Landing, das kann ja alles eigentlich nur schief gehen. Man sieht in King's immer Landing immer was schief. gut. <lacht> Für irgendwen. <lacht> Oder? Auch in der Serie, in dem Buch nicht. Fällt mir gerade nichts ein. Ja, ich glaube für alle Leute. Ja, für Littlefinger, der kommt immer ganz gut raus. Ja, das stimmt allerdings. If Lady Marjorie wrote a letter. Puh. Ich würde sagen, entweder schreiben wir diesen äh, Brief an Sir Maynard zu Ende. Oder wir könnten einen Brief fälschen. Aber ich würde sagen, diese Entscheidung heben wir uns für die nächste Folge auf. Okay. Obwohl ich schon eine Meinung habe. Aber mal gucken, was Daniel in der nächsten Folge entscheidet. Na dann. Ciao, ciao.